A human being, human being, is created always to be in need of. This is God's. He created us to be in need of, desiring something. Desire is one of the most, one of the precious gifts God gave humanity. Desire. Buddhism, the ultimate achievement, they're trying to kill desire. They are chasing the mirage in the wilderness. You're chasing something you cannot kill nor stop because what God gives, no one can take away. The ultimate, they believe, if you kill your desire, you become a God of your own. You are in control of everything else. Nothing will control you for as long as you have killed that desire in you. Once you kill the desire, you don't long for anything anymore. The moment you don't long for anything anymore, you're God, you're in control. But they have forgotten one thing. If I don't have desire, how could I long for God? God put it. But what do you need to do? Why you kill it? Control it. Manage it. Balance it. Instead of, de instead of desiring evil, desire good. Instead of desiring darkness, desire light. Instead of desiring death, desire life. Instead of desiring Satan, desire Jesus Christ of Nazareth. So this is the worldly person. Since we in, are in need of something or someone always. So a guy will come and he says, um, you know what? I need to get married. I have to get married. I can't stay single all my life. He gets married. After a little while, this is worldly people. After a little while, she's not good for me. I'm not going to get married. I'll just be content with a girlfriend. After a little while, having a girlfriend, nah, it's boring. So you know what? Maybe I'll take a guy next time. Try it. It's not working with girls. And then I'll take another guy. And then it doesn't work after a little while. I'm not content. You know what? I'm going to marry a dog, maybe a tree, maybe a rock. Maybe I'll become one of them. Your pursuit will never end because you will never be content until you find God. You'll never stop because no one fills your desire. No one fulfills your desire. No one completes your desire except the one who created you in the first place. His name is Jesus Christ of Nazareth. That's all the problem. They're missing on God. That's why they don't know what to do anymore.